talk, the better. You don't hear everything and it's challenging. Smiling at your neighbor is no longer the simple task it used to be, nor is making small talk in the grocery store checkout line. While wearing face masks may limit the spread of COVID-19, they also limit the ways we communicate with one another. I think we've all experienced how communication has changed this year. Um, you know, particularly when the plexiglass barriers went up in stores and then everyone started wearing masks. And then, you know, we also had to keep distance from each other. UBC's Dr. Lorian Genstad is a professor with the School of Audiology and Speech Sciences. She says those who hear well are now dealing with what the deaf and hard of hearing communities were already used to. I see it as becoming, you know, this universal challenge and hopefully even post pandemic we'll have greater empathy and understanding for what it means to have, you know, communication difficulties. Genstad suggests several strategies to break through the face mask barrier, like wearing clear face masks, using hand gestures and rephrasing what we're trying to say. We have this kind of rule that speak 10% louder, 10% slower, which just gets across the idea that you want to speak a little bit clearer, a little bit louder, but not in such a way that's really going to distort what you're trying to say. Another tip to try is to exaggerate facial expressions on the part of your face that is visible. As you can see, making a big smile under my mask crinkles my eyes and raises my eyebrows. You just have to articulate more too and repeat. Several people we spoke with all agreed it's been more difficult to communicate during the past year. If your hearing starts to go, <laughs> the face max doesn't help. I've only just realized in the last, honestly, probably the last week, so it's taken me a year, uh, how extra extroverted you have to be to communicate with people to communicate any form of positivity because this blocks off so much. It's hard. I'm a mumbler to begin with. And some have come up with their own ways to communicate while wearing face masks. I'd say you're trying to be more expressive in your eyes and definitely uh, volume. In Vancouver, Miranda Fatour, City News.